Okay. I've gone back to my base, I've dropped off tons of my gear, and now I'm going to be going for another round of Monk Genocide. Okay, so, on this part of the map, there's only a few monks left. Why not? Let's go kill them. I put my sights blocked here. Probably because of this thing here. Uh, well, that's kind of a buggy. What the monk suicide is going to do here? Uh. Well, that was obvious. He killed his friend. Hey, look, they finally opened the gate on me. Or maybe it got blown open. So I guess you got a little bit of time to run away from these guys when they blow up like that. So monk suicides aren't as dangerous as they look. Uh, you get to go here. Probably should use the better thing. So look at that. Unless your guy's glowing, they won't take a hit here. Zoom. Nice. Look at all that death. That's it for all of them. Suicide, lobber, gunslinger, gunner, gunner, lobber, gunslinger, gunner. Look at all that experience adding up for me. And you are now what level? 24 apparently. Uh. Get a little. Get that up there a little bit more, I guess. So yeah, him. You know, with him, I'm wondering if I should get him to uh, level the mechanical repair. I've got no critical. I got no critical failure on this for this guy, but he's doing a lot of our training and stuff. But whatever, let's just go for perks here. We're gonna go for interesting. You get more AP when you're below um, a certain amount of HP. Not sure I'd ever want to have that happen, but whatever. Berserker mode is berserker. We'll get this for you. You know, I bet the monks will be hostile if I approach from the other side, but whatever. Alright, scope. Let's give you this. You this.
This will be the first time I'll be able to run around here and loot stuff, I guess. So all the monks outdoors are done. There's no more monks up above. Now make it easier for getting in and out of the base now too. And you know what? I've yet to been over to this entrance. Or your you know, medical entrance. We'll pick this open. I forget, someone gives you a code for this, I think. Let's just get through here. Look up below. Like this is junk. Okay, where in the base am I? Oopsie. Alright, so I guess I appear over here. Oh, that was close. These ones are a lot harder to see, these bombs. I guess I'll have to focus on perception soon. But what's the chance for this feeling? Okay, not too low. Thought it might be low, but whatever. It's not. This looks like the medical lab over here. That looks like a detonator over there. Boink. Yeah. Looks like there's a few guys in here. Yeah. Uh. Boink. Okay, he's a little bit close. When does he go boom, I wonder? Oh, it turns into a nuke symbol over here, so that's when the nuke is going to go off, apparently. Um, so it's kind of dangerous he's about to blow. I took a little bit of damage for it, but well, it happened. There goes that guy. So it's not instantly fatal if those guys start coming at you with uh, their explosion. Alright, you need to move. Here. Uh, I should probably move this guy in, so let's do that. And let's go ambush. If I see him, he's gonna go boom. There's the big boom. Okay, you need to... There 
goes that guy. Trade him to pieces. Fire! Continually fire! Here's the thing, by the way, each of my bullets has a 46% chance of hitting this guy, so with machine guns, it really rocks to hit guys in cover, so. Kill him. Nice skill points in our stuff. Is that you? Yes, you hit level 20, cool. So, she's level 20. Uh, with her... Might make sense to give her more, more speed. Might also make, make sense to give her more strength. Let's give her speed for now, I think. Give her more action points and stuff in combat. And you're a little 21. Uh, for skills on this guy... Maybe I'll start focusing... Bit on mechanical repair, perhaps, at some point, or get a little, little more of this, I guess. And you, you're gonna get more perception just in case. Just in case. I need it. Delay is mutually assured destruction. Ha ha ha. All the inside jokes in this game. But this wouldn't be a good game if it didn't have its jokes and stuff. Bar. Another M16. So now I got another M16 here. Um, this is a scope. I know I'm getting quite a few of these. Maybe I should put one of these scopes on my rifle. Get a little bit more range. I'll keep this around for now. So much loot down here. It's all mine. All mine. Pure safe. More stuff. There's alarm to the same skills ago. So this is the army apparently over here. Oh, I walked into another trap. These traps really hurt these ones. One with the improvised explosive is going to yield me when I um, get to it.
This looks promising. Guys, that's one bad thing about trying to try and train your guys before running into this stuff. It's a little bit hard when you have a big group like this. Thank you gets to do this thing. This way, apparently. Yeah, I'm using perception at this point to have a look around. Right, step right into a trap. I right, want to see. You know, in many ways, the different, like, you know, medical packs and stuff like this, I'm sort of meshed to some of it. I sort of think, like, you should just have medical supplies and you just use, like, a certain amount of medical supplies based on, like, you know, um, the HP of characters, perhaps. I like this game, but in some ways, I think it could be improved. Okay, there's probably guys beyond this door. not. Running out of areas to explore here. Where's the medical part? <laughs> Boom! Almost killed that guy. There's still a nine monk in here. The nutty nutty monk. The nine monk I can't speak to for some reason. Probably glitchy or something. All I can say about him. All right, this is definitely medical area around here. Yeah, this is definitely where the medical area is. Ow. Ow. Okay, who have I got here? I've got Cripples, Basher, there's Kit, um, Cindy Kyle. I don't see anyone who's gonna be a suicider, so that's good. You're a good doctor. Uh, you can go here and open fire at this guy. 
Oh, I forgot to reload. Whoops. Go here. Ah, uh, shoot at him. We have enough AP to run out here, so do so. I thought that gunslinger was gonna get a bunch of actions there, but not gonna get now. Sit there. Big hit to the face. Charge. I wish we had a doctor back in Rail Nomad. Not this doctor. You don't want this doctor. She's gonna be a dead doctor. Finish off these guys. Whoops, I did again. Waste of ammo. And I'll strike corpse. They must all pay. Alright, I'm to vote them. I got experience for that one. Apparently the bashers here use crowbars. You are going to get more weapons with I guess. Oh, there's still people alive. Gotta kill them all. It's a freaking massacre. There was no survivors. Well, that looks pretty clear. Them alarms, they are annoying, aren't they? This is where I sort of wish this was, like, System of Shock, where, you know, uh, I play System Shock, and in System Shock, you have the ability to sort of, um, stop alarms from blazing by using security panels and stuff. I missed some. All the alarms are blazing. 
But all the monks are pretty much dead at this point. All that's pretty much left is to deactivate the nuclear missile and say hi to the Black Diamond Militia. This was not where I wanted to go, was it? I guess it was. Let's go to the big missile. Who's got the, uh, the thing? Bid rocket. So Titan is a fraud. I pu pu prove it. Titan is a fraud. A, fra um, a, fla uh, a fraud. Blah blah blah. That alarm's getting stupid. Hopefully this gets rid of it. Where is it? Uh, the thing I need. Here it is. this going to be? We still have the info the launch room, blah blah. The way clear for the DBM to invade. So that's pretty much done at this point. Let's get out of here. The alarm is annoying me and hopefully I'll find a DBM outside. D, 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 alarm, 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 alarm. So apparently with perception, you get bigger radiuses with more skill. And I guess you see more stuff as you get more perception too. Attack! And here comes this guy. I guess they give you a few months just to see you die. I wonder if this doc will actually help me too. Need some healing folks? You come to the right place. Well, let's see what I can do for you. Okay, all fixed. So cool, we got someone who heals me. Sadler. Well, you did it. I'm impressed. But I'm afraid we aren't done with you just yet. See, we made a disturbing discovery as we were mopping up in the silo. The monk's missile is a fake. There is no warhead. All the horse shit they've been spewing about Titan's wrath has been a bluff. Which means we're not much better off than we were before. Now fortunately, there's another silo out east, near to Manta. And I hear it contains a live missile. I also hear that a while back, one of the mad monks split from the rest, and went to Demanta to try to get it. Well, you're gonna get it first. 
Bring us that nuke, and I'll give you safe passage and what I already promised you, but at a discount. Got it? Good. Then get going. And remember, to bring the nuke here. This is our HQ now. Cool. And there's Silas 7. Hurry up! Alright, well. This is their place now. A short, fixed set man with a crew cut and adverse shades stand before the ordinance shade counter. He gives you a curt nod as you enter. What can I do for you? Here to trade? Yes, let's trade. Yes, let's. Alright, so this guy. Off the junk. See you, he says. And there's this place, of course. So, at this point, I pretty much have done everything here that, you know, I'm going to be able to do. Essentially, that is raining the monk's place, killing everyone. I feel like there's a storm over here, so that alarm's still blaring. That's annoying. I know so this guy's injured. Let's see if I can heal him up. Well, the Monta will be on the, uh, you know, the agenda next. None of these guys seem to talk to me at all. Oh, there he injured a guy. Get a little bit of experience for this, basically. And... There we go. Vendor approaches you, adjusting his hair. A new vendor. Hmm. Never seen this vendor before. So here is Dave Oshry. Sharp but broad, way too sure of himself, and almost definitely hung over. His sunglasses reflected ways clear as day. His hair is perfect. Hey, hey. Name's Oshry. Dave Oshry. But just call me Oshry. Actually, I don't give a shit what you call me. You've got a bad fucking headache, pal. You got scrap, I got time. And nothing but the best. Yeah, the best. So, what's it gonna be? You gonna buy, or you wanna walk? What do you mean the best? Ha! You ain't heard of me, have you? You got no idea, pal. Guns, armor, tools, you name it. And yeah, it's the best you're gonna find out in these parts, believe you me. So like I said, what's it gonna be? Let's buy. Good, cause for a second, I thought you were looking to fuck. And while I am flattered, that sure as hell ain't what I'm doing all the way out here. Okay, if you say so. But tell me, why the hell should I sell to you? Who you out here for anyway? Actually, scratch that. I don't want to know. Just answer the first goddamn question. It's been a long day. Um, you should sell because we can pay? That ain't good enough, brother. Like I said. I don't sell to just anybody. And you're just anybody till you're somebody, baby. War Ranger Team Echo, we save the Asia Center. Well, shit. That was you? 
Why didn't you say so sooner? Let me show you what I got to trade, hero. The motherfucking best. Okay. And look at that, he sells me explosives. I'm actually not against getting explosives from this guy. Maybe we'll get a mangler. Been a pleasure doing business with you. Well, not really. But hey, I'm richer all the same. Hey, hey. Okay, so this is Dave. Hey, hey. So, that's a new uh, merchant. That I've never seen before. And has audio lines. So yes, this will be probably fun to play out here, I think. I guess he's like the first guy you run to, Dave. Once things are sure, the radiation is a lot better over here. A lot lower. Alright, well. This has been a fun game. The DBM has taken over the rest of the, uh, you know, the monk silo. And we'll see where it goes from here. For now, take care.